Yo, what's going on everyone? Welcome back to my YouTube channel. Hope you guys are having a great day so far today. But in today's video, I'm gonna be showing you guys the best money method to do right now in GTA 5 Online. Now with today's money method, you can literally make millions of dollars. In this video, I actually made over six million dollars doing this money method. So if you guys do need money, this is gonna be the perfect video for you. But before getting into today's video, do me a favor, go down below, drop a like. It takes one second and it helps the video get out there to people who don't even know about my YouTube channel already. So make sure you do me a favor and drop a like. But now let's go ahead and get straight into today's video. Now for this money method, we're gonna be taking advantage of the double money and double RP special cargo crates right now this week in GTA 5 Online. So first First of all, let me show you guys how much I've made off this money method so far. So you can see right here, I go to special cargo. My total earnings off this money method, I've gained over $25 million doing this money method. So you can get lots of money. And you guys are going to need a CEO office, so make sure you guys go buy one on Dynasty 8 Executive. And I'll show you guys real fast, every single CEO office is on sale. You can see it used to be $3.1 million, now it's only $1.2 million. And you can even get one for $900,000. Take a look right here, that one's $900,000. And the one that used to be $4 million is only $1.6 million. So if you guys don't have a CEO office, you obviously will need one for today's video. And yeah, you're just going to want to go now in your CEO office and then sit down at your computer and then log in. Also, make sure you guys are in a public session. Now, you're going to want to also make sure you guys own at least two different special cargo crate warehouses. You can see I own this one. It's a large. And then you're also going to want to own another one. Now, it doesn't really matter what size it is. It can be small, medium, or large. Mine personally is actually medium. And it's very close to my CEO office. So make sure you guys just own two different special cargo warehouses. And if you guys do not know already, right now, special cargo warehouses are also on sale, but these are 50% off. So you can see right here, a small one is only going to run you right around $125,000, as you can see right here. Now, here's another one next to it. This one's actually a medium one, which is only $500,000. And let's go over here to a large, for example, or this is another medium one. See another medium one? It's even lower than $500,000. This one here is a large one. It's only $1.1 I know it's a little bit more. But once again, you can just get some small ones or medium ones. You don't have to get the large ones. And yeah, once you buy any two special cargo warehouses, now go to your warehouse warehouse map then you're gonna want to go to the special cargo warehouse closest to your CEO office and then go right here to where the option says three crates and it costs eighteen thousand dollars for these three crates just go ahead and confirm that purchase and once you confirm it now you're just gonna want to go get the three crates you can see this one was pretty simple most of them are pretty similar to this you just have to go to the location get the crates you can see right here I'm about to pick up a crate and once you get all three crates you just deliver them over to your special cargo warehouse you can see right here I'm gonna go ahead and skip the clip until when I delivered it you can see right here three out of three special cargo shipments are now delivered into my special cargo warehouse now what you're gonna want to do is exit your warehouse and then get any vehicle and make your way over to your CEO office like I said before you should have started the mission at the special cargo warehouse closest to your CEO office so you shouldn't be too far off so just go inside of your CEO office and then you're just gonna want to sit back at your desk and you guys are gonna notice right here the one that we just did is gonna have a wait time you can see it's a three minute wait time so now just go to your other warehouse that you got and then source three crates for this one so you can see right here I just click confirmed I'm now gonna go source these three crates for the other warehouse so you can do this back to back and now for this one was a little bit different this one's actually easier all i have to do is get this one vehicle and it counts as three crates so when you guys get these missions with only one vehicle that counts for three crates these are the best ones in my opinion you just have to do one trip and it's super easy so now once you get this uh these three crates just deliver them over to your special cargo warehouse like i just did right here and simply turn it in like this i'm not too sure if i showed you guys this already but three crates is actually worth seventy two thousand dollars so that eighteen thousand dollars that you guys spent turns into seventy two grand so it's a lot of money that you guys are getting profit and yeah once you guys deliver this special cargo simply exit and now i'm gonna give you guys a really good strat to do when doing these actual crate missions so from here once you exit just open up your interaction menu and you're gonna want to go to services and then request your terabyte you can see i already requested mine so just request your terabyte once you request it you're gonna want to go to wherever it's spawned in shouldn't be too far and then get it and bring it back over here to the special cargo warehouse so you can see right here i'm going to get it so once you've picked up your terabyte simply bring it back over here to the special cargo warehouse and park it somewhere nearby you can see i actually have a perfect spot to park it right here in front now the reason being for parking this terabyte in front of this warehouse is take a look right here on the map i'm gonna show you guys exactly why so now as you can see this special cargo warehouse is kind of far from my ceo office so that's why we put the terabyte in front of here so we can start up the missions in the terabyte instead of heading all the way over there to the ceo office it just saves time do you guys see why this strat's super op and then same thing goes for over there you can see the ceo office is already next to the special cargo warehouse so all i have to do when i finish doing crates over there is simply go across the street and i'll already be there to start up the next crate missions so from here obviously you're just going to want to go inside of your terabyte and then you're going to want to go to the keypad here click right d-pad and then you're going to want to go to the right where it says special cargo and then you're just going to want to source three crates and you can see this is the one that i didn't just do it's the one that i did at the beginning which is the special cargo warehouse that's closest to my ceo office so start up that three crate mission and just simply
simply just go get these three crates. You can see this one's like the same exact one. All I have to do is get the crates delivered over to the warehouse. And once I deliver it over to the warehouse, all I have to do is simply head back over to my CEO office. Since this one is really close to my CEO office, you can see I just delivered it. And yeah, once you deliver it, like I said, this one should be the one that's closest to your CEO office. So head over there. And once you guys head over to your CEO office, you're simply just going to want to source three more crates for the other one that's closest to the terabyte. Now, all you're going to want to do is do this strat back to back to back. So source three crates for one, source three crates for the other, and just keep going back and back and back until you guys get your warehouses both completely full. Once you guys get them both completely full, it will sell for a lot of money. Right now, I'm just going to go ahead and skip forward and show you guys how much money you guys get once the warehouses are completely full. So now I'm back and you can see my medium warehouse is now completely full. You can see every single shelf is completely stocked up with crates. And now I'm going to show you guys how much it sells for for having a medium warehouse completely full. So here I go on my laptop, you can see 42 crates out of 42 crates. It sells for $1.4 million. So a lot of money only for 42 crates. So right now I'm going to sell it and I'm going to show you guys how easy these sell missions are. You can see right here, all we had to do was get three of these trucks and deliver it over to a destination that was only like three miles away. So I did end up needing some friends, but they were nice enough to help me. I mean, it's pretty easy. All they had to do was deliver these vehicles three miles away. And once you guys all deliver these vehicles that are like three miles away at the destination, you can see now I just got my money, $1.47 million and a whole bunch of RP as you guys can see. So it is really good for having a medium warehouse completely full. Obviously, you guys want to have the large warehouses completely full, which I'm going to show you guys in the next clip but i know not a lot of people want to buy that expensive one but right now i'm gonna show you guys the large warehouse so you can see right here look at this the large warehouse is completely full now this one might take a little bit longer but with grinding it's well worth it i'm gonna show you guys how much money you guys will get for having this completely full and selling it i made a whole lot of money so you, all you have to do come over here to the laptop once your large warehouse is completely full and just click right d-pad obviously to go here and you can see 111 crates out of 111 crates sells for 4.4 million dollars that is a whole bunch of money and this one's honestly probably harder in my opinion to do than the other one that we did for the medium warehouse this one i mean it seems easy but trust me it's super super annoying i had to get a tugboat that is it's super slow it's slower than like a faggio and then i had to drive it all the way over to this destination i know it seems kind of easy but it was really annoying but once i ended up doing this i completed the mission it spawned me back over here and i got 4.5 million dollars so i got an extra one hundred thousand dollars and you can see that easy 4.5 million dollars for selling a completely full large warehouse so you can see i was not lying when i said i made six million dollars doing this one sold for 1.47 million and then this one sold for 4.57 million which is well over six million dollars which is a lot of money but yeah that basically wraps things up for today's video hope you guys didn't enjoy today's money method make sure you guys take advantage of this because trust me i know it might take a little bit of like work with grinding it but it is well worth it when it comes to the money at the end of the day so make sure you guys take advantage of this that's it for me and i'll see you guys in the next video peace